Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to another talking subject. This one is should Harry Kane leave Tottenham? Now we've all heard about the speculation about Harry Kane wanting to leave Tottenham and he has not you know, threatened that he wants to leave Tottenham. He has said if he wants to leave Tottenham he will do so even though Tottenham is his sporting club and you know as most players as we think that most boys want to play all, all for that club all the way through. Now there's a few couple of so topics I want to talk about. Some questions and I'm going to try and answer on my opinions. Or, or, you know you all three have your own opinions so do be, uh, don't be afraid to put them down in the comments below. It's going to be an interesting one because we all know that if you leave Tottenham or you leave an English club you will certainly could mess up your England career or could mess up your career overall. So I'm going to talk about you know a few subjects as I said, uh, why should he leave, why shouldn't he leave, all that kind of stuff for us. But anyway let's get through the wonder why so guys you know what to do, subscribe for more. Thanks for watching and let's go. And this video is sponsored by LOR T-shirt company. Send more merch, link for more merch is down in the description below. So the first question is why should he leave Tottenham? He could leave Tottenham on one or two reasons why he should leave. Further his career, silverware, you know, get experience playing abroad if he goes abroad. It could be a kind of, you know, intriguing question going forward. Why should he leave? I think he should leave Richard T. You know, it's what I think. I think as I said, you're all free to put your comments down below and express your opinions and where it can mess up his career and, you know, your answers to all these questions I'm about to answer. Um, so that's the first one. Yes, I think he should leave, but I think only to further his career. And, you know, no one really knows what they like abroad until you do it, a bit like Phil Kell when he came to United, then he went to Chelsea, I think he came from Monaco, and you know, he couldn't do nothing for me and I was Chelsea, went back home and he's scoring for fun again, so I think he should leave, it's a one in a lifetime opportunity for Harry, and it'd be interesting to see, does, to see where he ends up. The next one, why shouldn't he leave Tottenham? Now this is like the opposite effect of the pressure I just did. Why? It could really damage his career if he does leave. It could, as I said, really damage his career, what I've just said. It could damage his England career. Could, you know, end his career overall, if you know what I'm talking about. Like, when you leave to a big club and it doesn't work out. A bit like Michael Owen when he left for Real Madrid from Liverpool, I believe. And, you know, he didn't really get any game time for Real Madrid. How much would Harry Kane cost? This is another interesting opinion because of, you know, Harry Kane, I would he'd go for around 250 million, 300 million mark. But, you know, all, all the teams go have their price. I think the last amount he'd go for probably be around about 150 mil. And that's if Tottenham accepts it. Will he play in England? I don't think he will play in England. I think he's got too much respect for Tottenham. You know, if you look, look at Man United, let's go Man United first. Marcus Rashford, Martial, Greenwood. So you've got to be four strikers there with Harry. Can't see him fitting in. Then you go Liverpool, you go Salah, Firmino, Mane, Power 3. So he's got to be a number two striker there. I think he'd be good at Liverpool, but I think he'd be a number two striker. I do Arsenal, but he won't go there because obviously he's a top one boy. You've got, like I say, got a bang And you've got like, so many players that like at Arsenal. With Mick Arteta just, you know, fitting them in perfectly before this, all this stuff happened. City, you've got Aguero, Jesus. So there's going to be a three striker there. He's going to have to go somewhere where he is the main man. And I'm more thinking of Real Madrid or Barcelona. So it's going to be an interesting thing to see where he does go, but I don't think he'll be in England. Which club should he go to? Clubs going to, see this is another, when you've got the likes of Bayern Munich, Real Madrid, Barcelona, 
notorious top clubs that have got the star players. The only thing that really is ringing my bell at this present in time is Barcelona. Barcelona because Lionel Messi's contract's up at the end of the season, whenever that may be, and he is leaving Barcelona. Inter Milan could be another one. Um, Sanchez's deal is up at Inter at the end of this loan deal and Ericsson is at Inter already so Harry Kane can fit in nice and compact there so you know it's going to be interesting but I think he'll go abroad I'm especially thinking Barcelona though yeah I'm more 70-30 that he goes to Barca don't ask me why obviously we we'll have to wait and see what's clubs best for him now this is a question that you know, really fitting in, really setting him down quick, getting down to work. Inter Milan is like a top club that he will settle in quickly because Ericsson's already there. So, you know, you've got that to think about as well. But yeah, I'd we'll definitely go into for that one. What's best for his career? His best for his career is leaving Tottenham, which obviously answers my last question, which I'll bring up in a minute. But, I think it's best for his career to leave Tottenham as long as he don't go to Arsenal. If he goes to Arsenal, I know a few of you Arsenal fans and Tottenham fans, I can already see you commenting already, but if he goes to Arsenal, it will affect his Tottenham fans deeply, going to, going to his rivals. But, you know, it's got to be best for his career. But I think best for his career is going abroad. Do I think it's just that Tottenham? No, I think after Jose Mourinho has came in at Tottenham, I don't think he's really happy playing under Jose Mourinho, especially when they, you know, as you say, part the bus. When you part the bus, he's not seeing much of the ball, he's not getting much of the ball, I think he should definitely leave for the best for his career. But anyway guys, I'm going to bring this video to an end, guys, you know what to do, give us a big crap on if you enjoy it, subscribe for more, thank you for watching, Cheers.